welcome to today's video. I started picking out my outfits the night before and it is game changing guys all right so this is the outfit i am going with for today it's a little bit gloomy out it's getting a little bit cooler which i'm actually excited for because i love my layering in my jacket i also think i'm going to pair it with these shoes i have been obsessed with these which i'm really happy about because i bought them a couple years ago and i wore them for a trip and then i didn't wear them that much but i'm glad that i'm getting my wear in now now it's time to get ready it's time to get ready for the day I've missed talking to you guys so much and there's nothing I wanted to do more than to sit down and just chit chat while I'm getting ready. It is Friday. Welcome to today's video. Honestly, I just wanted to be better at filming more of my college experience since I am graduating so soon. I also, hopefully you can tell by now, but I'm testing some things out. I wanted to explore a little bit more with my editing. So I've been really excited to film more video diary vloggy style things. And of course, more college related stuff. If I'm gonna be honest with you guys, it's very easy to try to like niche down and tell myself that I belong to these certain categories of doing like only arts and crafts videos or only fashion videos or only, you know, this or that. Which, of course, I understand, like, specializing in something. But it's definitely also a little bit limiting on what content I'm going to decide to film or what, or just the way it shapes my channel as a whole. It's also just been pretty difficult. And, like, this always happens that I, I get so excited filming and posting during the summer and then my soul just gets crushed because I get so busy with school that it's just put on the back end, which I just am trying really, really hard not to do this year. Year, but I always like get drawn back to the same feelings of like oh this is what I was feeling for the past like three years it's not so much that I like you know don't have time to film it's like I'm so drained from school that I can't even think of picking up a camera look how stringy it is stuff goes crazy that's my little rant that little rant's always going on. Also just wanted to give you a little update. I've been at school now for almost a full month. I think this is finishing off week three of classes. Maybe week four. Why don't I know? I feel like I, for the most part, have my little routine down as far as school goes. I feel like I've said this in every video and I'm just a bit of a broken record, but I'm graduating at the end of this year, so I will be a college graduate, fingers crossed, as long as I don't fail a class, um, by December, which I feel like comes up in almost every conversation, but it still just doesn't process for me. Like, I think I don't realize I'm not going to be a student anymore just because that's been my for so long you know remember i always forgot to use deodorant so also i hope you guys can't hear my stomach growling right now i love this stuff But today, the only real plans I have are to go to school and then I really need to finish editing my video. But I think I am going to treat myself and go to a little cafe. I guess it's like treating myself, but at the same time, it's like, Melanie, you really need to focus and get this done. I don't know. Sometimes doing it at the library and doing it in my bed and at home and stuff hasn't been working for me. Plus, I honestly just don't go to cafes that much anymore, which I know is shocking because it was like such a main pillar of my identity but since i got an espresso machine i just make my coffee at home every day and i'm so happy with it which i still think is fine but long story short i want to go to a cafe today guys i'm really heartbroken i feel like my lashes have got cut short or something anyways it is about 10 30 now and i'm gonna try to leave by like 11 15 my only class today is at noon to two 
um, but I like to give myself plenty of time because I just don't like feeling rushed for stuff but my stomach is making the most atrocious noises so let's go make some breakfast I've been the biggest toast girly recently And then on top of that, and my housemates told me to get this cheese from Trader Joe's. It's called like something famine bear or something like that, carmen bear, something with a C. But it is so delectable. I know this is a very basic, very simple meal slash snack, but I have been looking forward to it. So good. I didn't have any hot honey, so I just used normal honey. And then I added some chili flakes. The honey I used was actually from Alex's family because his dad recently got bees. So now they have like 50 gallons of honey. Okay guys, so we are all packed up, ready to go to school, but I just did want to shout out that I've been packing my lunches recently. I got this cute little thermos off of Amazon. I love the colorway. I don't really like this gold thing going on here, but it's helpful that it has a handle. But I just feel so adult with this, so prepare. Let's head to school. I'll catch you guys once I'm there. Hi friends, so I just parked at school. I have like 10 extra minutes to kill, so I just like sit in my car a lot of the times. But I don't know what's going on today. Actually, I do know what's going on. I didn't sleep enough and I didn't drink coffee yet because I was saving it for the cafe, which is just silly. But now I'm just so tired and I just need to get through this class. <laughs> I just got out of my one class for the day. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not feeling the best. I'm just like exhausted and I don't know why. I got like seven and a half hours of sleep, which I feel like should be enough for a college student, but I'm just, I was sleepy in that class. But I'm excited to eat a little bit. I'm such a car girly now, like not, not a car girl, but I like just sit in my car for probably like two hours a day that was that was very much an over exaggeration but i do sit in my car a lot just like in between classes and sometimes i feel like it's easier to just like eat in my car than like go somewhere i don't know i'm gonna go to a cafe and do some editing which is nice because editing's always like a little break for me like it doesn't feel like work this cup are pretty cold not bad i will admit if i edit at nighttime like after the sun goes down i get so tired like it'll almost instantly knock me out like i think i need to edit in the morning when i have like coffee or a drink next to me and i'm sitting up straight like anytime i try to do work in my bed instant knockout anyways this is a little salad that i love making it's basically my sweet greens order i don't know what it's like i'm sure it has some kind of name i don't know what the name is so good i was literally filming and it stopped filming but that's okay i was gonna hype up my salad to you guys because it's like my favorite recipe and i'm not really i'm not a chef whatsoever i think it's so good it's just arugula or spinach wild rice apple sweet potato goat cheese and then like chicken breast or turkey breast and like a balsamic or vinaigrette 
and I started making it at home and it's so good like I feel like I could eat it every single day for lunch and not get sick of it and you know your lunch is good when you like look forward to eating it after class like that's me right now I'm going to relax and eat and I'll catch you guys when I arrive at my next location <laughs> guys i don't know what it is but i am genuinely so pooped from today i have pretty busy wednesdays and thursdays but for some reason i think it's consistently been hitting me on friday so by the time i have my weekend i am just exhausted i was able to finish most of my video at the cafe which i'm really glad about um i just need to upload it and make my thumbnail which is like my little treat to myself because i love making the thumbnails um but i think i'm just going to honestly just lay on my bed i am not a huge napper whatsoever i also randomly asked on my instagram story if you guys have any documentary recommendations because i just randomly feel like watching i'm going to unpack and just of course change into some comfy clothes i do have some things that i need to get done but as her right now, I need to breathe it. I live where you love, the life that I'm living. I'm grateful for the and I'm grateful that right now I it's in this tan color. Sliders and I throw them in the trash. My food is literally cold because it takes me so long to decide what I'm gonna watch. I chose this random one about like the food industry. It was like one of the first ones that came up, funny enough, because it took me so long to choose one, which maybe I shouldn't watch while I'm eating and maybe I shouldn't watch as a whole because I feel like I'm really paranoid about food and like food poisoning and everything, but I'm just gonna give it a go and i just want to eat i'm hungry i'm so excited to eat this this is literally like not even that fancy i don't cook very fancy at all unfortunately i just always wait till i'm starving and then i end up making frozen food but i feel like it still like tastes good i just used the trader joe's frozen um broccoli beef which i've never tried before but i took a little bite and it was pretty good anyways i'm gonna watch this and dig into my food i probably see 10 15 different items the products been contaminated or sued companies on behalf of victims. It starts to feel though like like nothing is safe and like you can't eat, right? <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, the industry they send us these mixed messages. And I believe it is. People reported getting sick, being hospitalized for liver dysfunction, and even having their gallbladders removed. <laughs> Hi friends, it's editing Melanie here, much in the future, but I'm actually ending off this video because 
I'm editing it and I realize I have so much content that I'm already at 15 minutes even though I filmed the whole weekend so I made the executive decision to just split this up in to multiple videos and hopefully you guys don't mind just because i really like all the footage that's in it just like the more videos the merrier but thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this vlog which turned out to just be more of a day in the life as a college student as pepperdine um, and being productive and doing work but i hope that you guys enjoyed it make sure to stay tuned i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i'll see you all in the next one Bye guys.